Hello Toromanians. I am sure that the majority of us traveled at least one time with an airplane, right? We have plenty of choices when it comes to the flight companies, but how about the manufacturer of the airplanes? I remember a funny story when a friend told me how uncomfortable are the airplanes made by a national flight company. That's why today our video is focused on a city with one of the biggest airplane manufacturers worldwide. Seattle is a seaport city on the west coast of the United States. With an estimated 756,000 residents as of 2021, Seattle is the largest city in both the state of Washington and the Pacific Northwest region of North America. According to U.S. Census data released in 2021, the Seattle metropolitan area's population stands at 4 million inhabitants and ranks as the 15th largest city in the United States. The city is situated on an isthmus between Puget Sound and Lake Washington, about 100 miles or 160 kilometers south of the Canada-US border. A major gateway for trade with Asia, Seattle is the fourth largest port in North America in terms of container handling as of 2015. The Seattle area was inhabited by Native Americans for at least 4,000 years before the first European settlers Arthur A. Denny and his group of travelers, subsequently known as the Denny Party, arrived from Illinois via Portland, Oregon and named Seattle in 1852, in honor of Chief Sile of the local Duwamish and Suquamish tribes. Today, Seattle has high populations of native Scandinavian, African, and Asian Americans, as well as a thriving LGBT community that ranks sixth in the U.S. for the population. George Vancouver was the first European to visit Seattle in May 1792 during his four-year-long expedition to chart the Pacific Northwest. Seattle's first economic growth boom was built on the timber industry. Early arriving developers converted a forest of trees more than 1,000 years old and 400 feet high into logs, and then milled timber for shipping to San Francisco. The Boeing Company, founded in the Seattle area by William Boeing, was originally a boat company. World War II meant significant growth for Boeing, when the U.S. government suddenly needed tens of thousands of plans a year, making Boeing the largest employer in Seattle. While Boeing plants and laid off 70,000 workers after the war, the company soon reinvented itself as the world's leading producer of commercial passenger planes. During World War II, Seattle was the point of departure for many soldiers sent to the Pacific. Many of these soldiers quartered at Golden Gardens Park. Seattle is the birthplace of Starbucks, the world's largest coffee chain. You can buy a unique mug at the original Starbucks in Pike Place Market, which first opened in 1971. Medina is the home of one of the United States' wealthiest men, Bill Gates, co-founder and former chairman of Microsoft. Mr. Gates has a net worth of $132 billion, according to the 2021 Forbes ranking. Seattle is home to the world's first gas station, opened on East Marginal Way in 1907. The 1919 Seattle General Strike was the first general strike in the U.S., with 60,000 shipyard workers. Today Seattle has two downtown cruise terminals and is a major departure port for Alaska and Pacific Northwest cruises. The city is ranked the most literate city in the country with the highest percentage of residents with a college degree or higher. Seattle was the first city in the U.S. to play a Beatles song on the radio. Its annual rainfall is less than that of Houston, Chicago, and New York. The Washington State Ferry System is the largest in the country and the third largest in the world, carrying more than 25 million passengers each year. That was all for today guys. Thank you very much for watching. And don't forget to leave a like, share, subscribe and hit the notification bell button for more videos like this.